Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to enable the new Open With dialog box for Windows 11. So normally if you right click on a file and you do Open With and choose another app, you have this looking screen right here. So what you could do is you could run this command using the Vive tool, which is used for a lot of uh, Windows tweaking, and get the uh, upcoming new style. So the only catch is you're going to need to be on uh, at least 25151. So this is a dev channel uh, Windows 11 computer, so it's it's not running the uh, retail version. So depending when you're watching this, you might have this already, or you might not have the right build to do it. So I guess you could check your build under the uh, settings. And then about. Right there. So to do this, we're going to open an administrative command prompt to start. And so I downloaded the Vive tool zip file right here. Then I extracted the zip file to my C drive right here. So I need to navigate to that directory wherever you extracted it to. So CD space C colon backslash Vive because that's where I put it. So now I need to run this command here. So it's Vive tool enabled with the ID. So you can just copy it, right click to paste it in there, enter. So it says successful. So now you could either restart the computer or you could restart Windows Explorer. So if you right click the uh, start button, go to Task Manager. I'll close this out here. And find Windows Explorer, usually near the bottom. Restart, you'll see your icons disappear. And come back. Okay. So now, I kind of took away my color too, but it does that sometimes when you restart Explorer. So now when I right click on the uh, Vive tool here, or actually any file to uh, use Open With, choose another app. Now you can see we have this kind of updated looking version that matches kind of the Windows 11 theme. So it has the same settings, you know, default app, then some suggestions. Then you could browse Microsoft Store for apps or choose another app on your PC. And then there's the always and just once option. So same thing, just a different look. So, And then if you change your mind, you can run this again and just change this to disable. And then restart Windows Explorer once again. And then you'll be back to the way things were. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.